Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Also, welcome to the Nerds. Today we're here outside Epic Universe once again for another construction update. See what is going on and what is new as we can see from the outside looking in. So I have y'all join me. It's gonna be an awesome time. So come along with me. And taking a look at this right off the bat, it is looking amazing from the outside. This is Stella Nova. It looks awesome. Look at that, man. The whole side is wrapped out here. I believe the other side is almost done. There's like a middle portion back there. And I still don't know like how it's gonna look on the bottom. I gotta look at like the concept picture again, see how that looks. But like this glass part right here kind of reminds me of Aventura and also Cabana Bay, but it's also really awesome. And another piece right here has been brand new as well. This is basically gonna be like an outside bar, maybe like a bathroom, but like it looks like basically an outside bar. You can kind of see it right here. That's where the pool is going to be. So a lot of progress is being made. And if you didn't know, between the two hotels, it's basically going to be flopped around like the um, parking is going to be on that side and this is the pool. And on this side, um, this should be where the parking is. That's what it looks like from like the concept pictures and the pool's going to be over there. And here's a closer look at this facility over here looking pretty awesome. And over here, it looks like this is actually where the pool is going to be. Alright, now coming on down, this is actually a really cool point between the two hotels and also looking inside Epic Universe towards uh, Grand Helios Hotel. And you can see a lot to this point, and I'm going to zoom in more because you can actually see a lot just over here, which includes Dark Universe, uh, Grand Helios, the Tender World. You can all see way in the distance, I can kind of see the sun just shining on the wand from the Wizard World Ministry of Magic. Alright, now looking inside the park, you can actually see in the middle of the screen, you can actually see it shining. That is the hand with the Elder Wand. It's looking awesome with the sun hitting it. Of course, to the right, you can see the Tender World. That's Donkey Kong Country, I think it's what it should be called. Mount Beanpole, it's going to be really awesome. It has that facade with the whole temple right there. That's cool, man. And of course, Helio's Grand Hotel it is looking awesome. It has also like a, like a bar rooftop on the top of it, but I'm not sure what it's going to be. But honestly, it looks really awesome. And of course, we do have Dark Universe has the, uh, the coaster over there. It's really hard to see the coast now with all this foliage and also some road work over here going on. But this is some awesome view right here. All right, so now come a little bit down looking at Terra Luna. It looks like we actually have more work from the, like this reflective tiling moving on down to these corners over here. Look at that. Pretty awesome right there. And also work has been started on this side as well. And I don't know if it's been started on the other side, but like this is definitely progress. I would say the next two months, this will be done. So before we actually move on from the hotel, something I actually want to mention again, um, this is reverse then that side over there because this is actually the pool area of a facility out there. This like a little glass area over here. This side is actually what it looks like over there with like this um, on and overhang has where basically you park your car, you know, get your unload your luggage or like where your family is at, drop people off, or see about Uber. That's where you're going to be dropped off right over there. All right, guys, one last look at the hotels over here and a view looking inside. This is amazing with sunset, man. Look at that thing, especially with a completed, well, basically completed side over here. It's pretty awesome. And I guess we won't be seeing any um, ride testing tonight. I mean, they could be testing anytime. That's their schedule. Whatever they do is what they do, of course. But it's pretty awesome. They have been testing the World Coaster, um, the Yoshi Omni River, and of course the High Train Dragon Flat Ride. And there's no matter of time when they should be testing the Donkey Kong Coaster because um, BioReconstruct already shared a picture of the cart actually on the track, but like it was covered, had the envelope, make sure it doesn't hit anything. But it's some pretty cool stuff. And of course, one more look inside, looking at Gr Helio's Grand Hotel and Dark Universe. We can actually see the World Coaster just a bit with the track, but um, it's really hard to see with all the foliage and trees, but still an awesome look. Alrighty, so now I actually finished up the resorts again. There is this facility right there. I think this honestly popped up out of nowhere, but honestly, that part just take like no time to build. They probably actually get like the sets or these little pieces from off lot and actually just put together right here probably takes no time at all but also in the middle you can see the spire from um how to train dragon isle burke that's the little um spire i think it's called the mead hall i do believe but it looks awesome and here's a closer look that looks pretty awesome and of course you can see one of the flat rods right there from how to train dragon and it's supposed to be one of the dragons i can't really see the color from here 
but you know it's supposed to resemble um dueling dragons and actually as i move down we can actually see both of the dragons in the air that is a pretty cool shot and also starfall racers in the background and also i'm going to share this picture really quick from bio reconstruct all right so just shared today on the 9th here is one of the full coaster cars for Starfall Racers. This looks awesome. You can actually see in the front of the car, it actually has, it's like a shooting star, has like space theme to it. It actually looks really cool. Um, the ride vehicle sells where the restraints are. Remind me of like a Bush Gardens kind of coaster, like in the north somewhere, but like it looks really awesome. And as I keep moving to the side, we keep getting better glimpse of the coaster itself and take a look at that that is pure awesomeness and of course you can see the portal for how to train a dragon right there all right now heading down we actually have a new road name constellation way check that out that's super cool it's probably like a actual back road for epic universe not sure it's like a work road but i guess we'll find out soon but then this is really awesome take a look at these views man, that's awesome and of course over here is epic boulevard oh that's so awesome all right now so coming back the other way near epic boulevard i feel like these palm trees over here are brand new so additions are being made as we go for the entrance over here it's looking awesome all right guys that's wrap it for another epic universe construction update video from the outside looking in of course we can't see a lot from the outside but we can see some stuff like probably the biggest thing is helios grand hotel like it's looking super awesome i'm telling y'all like i think the biggest thing that's going to really like really top it off is that gold part right in the dome at the top that's going to look super cool kind of like um you can already see from the road um the the, the hand with the golden wall on the portal from the ministry of magic that looks really cool, but like that part for the dome, that's gonna be awesome. I'm telling y'all. But um, look, moving on to the resorts as well, um, Terra Luna, um, it's actually receiving some of its um panels on the sides. So probably I don't know how to, they do that. Like it's like paint by number, but with tiles. I don't know, but it's really cool regardless. I really enjoy seeing the progress like on the tiles up. It's super awesome. And of course, um, Stella Luna, or is it? Stella Nova, I get those two confused <laughs> with the names, but um, anyways, Stella Nova, um, the tiles are done the front side, but I think they're about done on the back side, and of course we can see on the front from where we face on the road, um, that little facility, it's not little, but like it's a decent size, probably it's going to be like a bar and like maybe the bathrooms all in one building, but that should be pretty cool. And also we can see a little bit of the shape of the pool, but it's really hard to see from the ground, but you can see it. So that's me a really cool thing as well when everything's all done. And of course, going down the road, we did have a name for that road, Constellation Way. Now, I thought it was maybe just called like Service Road or something like that, but it's actually called Constellation Way, which is really cool theming for a road. But um, anyways, that will do it here for today. Um, really cool little update. Um, nice weather. It was actually really hot earlier. Like it's getting up there. Like spring break's coming. The weather, like almost that peak, you know, that summer feel. Like it's getting there. Like it's about to get hot. But um, anyways, it felt really good actually walking out there. It wasn't even that bad. But um, anyways, that's gonna wrap it up today. Um, cannot wait to come back again and see more progress here at Epic Universe. But um, anyways, if you enjoyed this video, a big old thumbs up and subscribe channel for more future content. I will see you guys next one. Thank you so much for watching.